For Insider Medicine in 60, I'm Allison Chow. From Maryland, the FDA is warning that the popular class of antibiotics called fluoroquinolones, which includes Cipro and Avalox, may raise the risk of tendinitis and tendon rupture. While tendon rupture is seen in about 1 in 100,000 people, use of these medicines appears to triple the risk. More cases appear to affect the Achilles tendon. From Malawi, in developing nations, Infants born to HIV-positive mothers are at risk for becoming HIV-positive through exposure to breast milk. According to research in the New England Journal of Medicine, use of antiretrovirals for an extended period of time can lower the risk of HIV transmission by 50%. However, with continued breastfeeding, the risk of transmission remains present. And finally, back to Maryland. The FDA has approved a diagnostic test that can assist doctors in deciding when to offer Herceptin to patients with breast cancer. The test, called Spotlight, requires a small tissue sample from the tumor and detects HER2 mutations which affect about a quarter of women with breast cancer. The test may eliminate the need for assays that involve the more complex FISH test. For Insider Medicine in 60, I'm Allison Chow.